guys, so today I'm going to be doing a haul, as you can see by the title, probably for um, home stuff. If you did not know, we are redoing our entire kitchen, and I'm taking you guys step by step. Um, the first video of the before tour should be up, and if so, I'll post it right here. But um, I want to show you guys a lot of stuff that I got. Most of it's for the kitchen. There's a few things that aren't for the kitchen. They're more, more so like for the bathroom or the laundry room, which are kind of in the same area. So, a couple things really quickly. I am going to be like out of breath. I'm pregnant if you don't watch my vlogs. So anytime I talk for more than like three seconds, I get out of breath, but I'm fine. I went to four different stores. Um, some more, I think only one isn't really that exciting. Let's go ahead and get started. Um, we'll start out with stuff that isn't really um, too exciting. And I went to um, Dollar Tree. You guys know I love Dollar Tree. I go there whenever I can just to see like what kind of stuff they have so I don't have to go somewhere else and pay, you know, more money for it. The first thing I got is actually this and it's just a um, like a dustpan. They call they call it a lobby dustpan, I guess, and it's only a dollar. And this will be perfect because um, we use like a uh, a mop like with like a microfiber cloth. And then I just use a small dust or a broom and then sweep it into it. But if I can find one the same size as this, that would be really good to sweep it up. Like I said, not really exciting stuff in this store. Um, I got two of these salt and pepper shakers. The only We have the regular ones where you can like get the fresh salt and pepper and you grind it. But um, the other ones that we have are just like ho or holiday like oriented. And they're more for like Thanksgiving because that's when I bought them. So we need basic ones. So I got two of those. I got a whole bunch of sponges because I need them. Um, so I got these cleaning microfiber pads. And then um, also these scrubbing pads. And then these softer pads. The one thing I can say, a quick tip for anyone who like cleans their house. I always buy these. They come two in a pack. Um, and they're only a dollar. And I, I hate cleaning my toilets with like something I'm going to reuse, but I don't want to spend a whole bunch of, like, paper towels to clean, like, the outside of the toilet. But I never, even, like, I've used, like, real towels. I've never been able to keep the towel and wash it, even if I have to bleach it, because I just feel gross, like, maybe this is the towel that I clean the toilet with. I don't know. I'm just weird like that. And I could separate them, but I feel like I just want to toss it. So I always buy these, and they're basically 50 cents. And there's different kinds. You can probably find some with, you know, more in the pack. But these 50 cents to use one day to clean all four of my toilets and then toss it is a good deal for me so I got a bunch of those and yeah that's pretty much it so that's pretty much it for Dollar Tree that was not very exciting but I want to show you guys anyway it's for Christmas and I asked for these um, and I got actually four of them but I'm only going to show you the two sizes um, there are they're from Pier 1 and uh, canisters from um, Pier 1 they're really cute I like them because they can just open um, okay, well, they can't just open now because they have plastic on them. But they're really nice. And they do also have chalk um, board so you can write on them. And I have a cookbook or a recipe box that I'm getting made that has a chalk board so I think it'll coordinate. And if I don't want to show this, I can always just turn it around. It does come with chalk. This is the biggest one that I have. And um, this was 14 bucks. I got it for Christmas. I probably shouldn't know how much it costs, but I do. I don't know how big this is though. Then I also got one that's this size. I'm not going to open it. It looks the exact same as this one, but um, it's just a smaller size. So I got two of the bigger ones and two of the smaller ones for Christmas. And I just, I'm the type of person where I like to keep everything together. And then when it's time to put the kitchen together, I'll put all of the stuff in the same time and it'll just look glorious. So that's that. And um, next we will do Marshalls, which. Marshalls for me means going to Home Goods. Now we do have a Home Goods that's actually closer to where we live now, but we used to live almost an hour away from where we stay now, and um, we happen to be out there. And they do have a small section. You guys know they put Home Goods in certain uh, stores, so I picked. Uh, I was stopped in there and got some things. I do want to go to the actual Home Goods store that's closest to us though, pretty soon. So there might be a part two for the haul. But I got um, a whole bunch of these OXO. Um, Good grip containers and they were they were a couple bucks off I believe I hope so at least if not I've already bought them so I was gonna buy them anyway but um so I have this one which is the 1.5 quart and it's $8.99 and then I have um, two of these which are what are they 
uh, 3.4 and these were $12.99 and then I have one of these and this is $9.99 and it is the 2.4 and then I bought one of these. Um, I bought one of this size, which is 2.5, and this one was 10.99. Um, they did have a lot of them, so if you're interested, I know Home Goods differ from store to store, but if you're interested, you could check it out. And they, you know, they sell them everywhere. I also saw these at Target for a little bit more expensive than what I paid for at Home Goods, but they were on um, like sale. Next, I got this whisk. Um, and this was $2.99. I like this one because it's like the metal, silver, steel, whatever you want to call it, and it's black. Um, and I like this for like my glasses when I'm, I have like the metal whisk that, um, with the actual, this part, the part that you use is metal. And it tends to scratch my glass mixing bowls. I never actually see the, the um, like marks, but I really just want one to see if it works better. So I got that. Um, and then... So I commented a long time ago, or not a long time ago, but a while ago on a, a vlog that said I wanted to get more um, cutting boards. And like literally right after that you guys were saying use plastic and things like that for your meat and um, use wood for your meat, for your vegetables. I can't talk today, evidently. Anyways, and I actually had read like right before you guys like made all those comments, so thank you for that, that I should do that. So I did, and I bought these. I was going to buy some from Amazon, but um, these were cheaper. These were $4.99, and you get four. So you get one for beef, seafood, poultry, and then vegetables. And I'll probably use the last one for, like, pork or something, just because um, I can just use the bamboo ones that I have. But nice little colors, and they have different colors. Um, but $4.99 for these are a really good deal. So, moving on to, what am I at? Ross. I stopped by Ross as well. Um, and the first thing really is not for the kitchen. It's for the laundry room, but it was really cute. So, um, it's this little sign. And this was $6.99. And it just says, tumble dry, clothespins, yada, yada, yada. I thought this would be cute. This is probably the color that I'm going to go for in my laundry room when we, when we do, like, refinish it or redo it. Um, I'm just not quite sure yet, but uh, I picked this up. And then the next thing I picked up I'm so excited about was this huge batter bowl. And I think this will be super nice. I do have um, mixing bowls and I also have a KitchenAid. But when I am making stuff by hand or even I'm just making something from a box, this would probably be really good so that I can um, use my batters and make my batters. And also get something very handy from Target that will go along with this. But this was $4.99. It's from the Anchor brand. And this is eight cups, well, two quarts, I guess. Um, and then next, um, we have um, a like bar. We have bar stools up here uh, to sit at for like our breakfast nook or whatever. And so I wanted to get um, padding for them or little pad seat covers. And I got these, and I think these will match perfectly with. Um, our kitchen and kind of the decor I think I'm going for. I'm not exactly too sure what I'm going to do for sure, but I think I know and this will go well. These are actually only $7.99, which is a freaking steal because I found a group, a pack of four for $14.99 at Walmart. They were not designed. They were just plain and they were super small, so I returned them and everywhere else they're like $14.99 a piece. So these for $7.99 is amazing. <laughs> Finally, for Ross, I did get two trash cans. Let me get them. They look like this. I love them. They're super uh, small. I like the, the neutral look, so that way if I ever decide to change, I could. These were $7.99, and they're in this chocolate brown. So I'm going to use one for the bathroom right off of the kitchen. And then the other one um, is going to be for the washroom that's in our uh, master bathroom and then finally is my target haul you probably guys you know I cannot not go to target ever like I love it and um, I have my receipt to kind of tell you guys prices but um, okay starting off first this is the thing that I was referring to that would help with the batter um, cup that I got or bowl that I got and it's from OXO and it's a two-piece uh, bowl scraper set. And it was on clearance actually for $5.24. It was originally $10.49. And it just comes with two of these. Now, I do have like a dough cutter. I don't know if that's what it's called. 
Anyways, I have one that I've tried to use, but it doesn't work if it's a, a round bowl. So I'm hoping these will help to get all that batter because, I mean, you want that. And for five bucks, well, six bucks, I guess, it's a really good deal. And then I got two of these things, which they actually were cheaper, cheaper at Target, which normally doesn't happen. Um, the first one is, sorry, my little girl is going to get off school a little bit, so I'm trying to like make sure I don't miss her bus. Um, this is the smaller one, and this was $8.99, and I got the bigger one, and the bigger one was $12.99. Um, I actually bought these for under the seat. Michael is going to build a pull-out sh uh, shelf, and I'm going to use one for like pads and stuff and um, microfiber cloth and all that, and the next one for cleaning. So I got those. I got this for the bathroom, um, and it kind of goes, I have three picture frames that kind of basically look like this with the black and like the gold, antique gold, and I thought this would be nice to put on the wall um, somewhere in there, and these were $19.99 for a set of three. Almost done. Um, and so, sorry, I had to kind of scoot up some. My butt was getting numb. But I bought this. Um, I love this. I don't even know her name. Yidia? Yida? I have some other stuff from her line from Target, but I think maybe they're going out of business or maybe they're like redesigning her line or something because everything was like discounted. So I picked this up honestly because it was just so cute. I can't say anything else about it. Um, it it's a two or a, tar a 20 ounce butter warmer. I don't know. Um, and it was 908, originally 1819. It's the cutest little thing. And I mean, I could use it for that, or like oatmeal in the morning for Jalen when I'm cooking and I don't really want to use a big pot. I mean, it's cute. I got it. That's really all I can say. And then I got this small um, strainer. This was only like four bucks, I believe. Yeah. Um, this was four seventy nine, and it's good. We don't really need that big of a strainer because it's only three of us. Um, so we don't really need that much. And then the last thing I got was kind of on a whim thing while I was there and it is this KitchenAid food chopper it's just in white and this was originally $8.99 it was on clearance for $13.28 um, and it's supposed to just you stick it in there and then push it in and it'll chop I don't know if it's gonna work all that well but it'll be great if it'll help me not have to do as much alright guys so that is pretty much the end of my haul for the kitchen if you like this video and like more videos regarding the kitchen please give it a thumbs up I'm gonna try to include everything I can about the kitchen I know when I filmed um, well when Michael filmed him refinishing the floors which I will put that right here if you haven't seen it people were asking to see the progress and everything that we're doing so we will do that soon. We're actually going to be painting um, this weekend coming up. Today's Friday. So this week coming up, sorry. We're going to be painting, so I'll take you guys along with that. Um, please, if you have not, make sure you subscribe for more videos. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.